Hi, T5 Sai si in the chat saying what's up to everybody. Try hard. Uh huh. Uh, sure, I'll give it to you. I think EX Plague is trying to tell him he wants to button button check. <laughs> Man, tell him it's a button check. <laughs> oh, I think he's yeah. trying to tell him. Oh, they figured it out. They figured it out. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Yay. Or I don't know. Yeah. Oh, it's a button check. Okay. okay. <laughs> trying to tell him it's a button check. They don't know oh, how to do it in Japan. White Tower wants to know: Is that Auto Demon? <laughs> <laughs> Kappa. Oh man. Kappa. That's funny. <laughs> Tokido Spy. Toddy. I, I, I like that. Tokido Spy, huh? I think spies are cool, so I'm not even going to be mean in saying that. But we have Toddy. Right now we have button checks. Sam Kelly, uh, of course, uh, looking at this match in the background very intently. I like how Sam Kelly disappeared as soon as Toddy had to play his match. Yeah. He was like, oh, I need. I need to make sure I check this guy. You should see the stern face that Sandra gave me when I said his name, by the way. He looked at me and said, yeah, I'm observing. What about it? I am most definitely observing with great intensity, Sandra Kelly. <laughs> oh, man. Let's go. All right, so Tidy's going to be on the player one side, and his opponent, EX Plague, will be on player two. Game number one, let's go. So we saw a little bit of his Ken during casual play, but it's tournament time now. Time to so, get serious. Yep, no more kidding around. Ooh, nice sweep. sweep. He tried to bait DP with a back dash. Yeah, good patience from Toddy, and we can see, uh, oh, that was sick. Very nice All right. I'm, I, I would be a little bit scared if I was EX Plague right now because he's showing matchup specific knowledge versus Oni Akuma. Great focus on the Torch Spears. Sick stuff from Another Toddy focus so attempt, no good. Oh no, random EX. Wow, Ouch, okay. that hurts. Overhead. That's Minus unsafe. five on that. Yep. Oh no. Lots of pressure from EX Plague here, but he cannot keep Tidy pinned down. Uh, Tidy's superior movement, good use of focus, and neutral jumps have all helped him out. Yep. Another nice jump there, just to throw EX Plague off his game. He seems to be very familiar with this matchup. Nice counter grab. This could be the end. Set up. Oh, that was nasty. Very ambiguous. So what he did there is, I believe that he expected the delayed wake up, and so empty low yep. was a good option for he him. He could have done EX Tatsu there too to get the cross up, so that was pretty ambiguous. He's saving setup. it. I think he's saving. Oh my god, that was hard oh, to see. He tries. Missed that FADC combo. That combo is actually really hard. Wow. Is nice tried to get a setup, but EX play. Hard throw. Here we go. This okay. is where Oni Displays is best. Time. Nice. Got him. Can't stand tech. Don't grab me. Ooh, nice. EX Plague can close it out. Not the right combo. I feel like if he had gone for a jump and he could have finished them there. Yep. Still got him in the corner. Yep. Yes. Very nice. That was nice. Very good stuff from EX Plague. Oh, no confirm from the counter hit. Okay. Both players about even, and lots of people are watching this match really closely. I see Lazy One, RLBS, Henry Sen, Dominion, uh, Shorjuken is watching. Pretty much everybody is watching this match closely. They're curious to see what Tidy can do versus EX Play. Miss the FADC again. Uh, I will take this time to point out that there are very, very small differences in timing between the arcade version of Street Fighter 4 and the Xbox 360 version. And if you switch between both versions, uh, you'll especially have trouble with FADCs like what Tidy is having here. Yep. I'm surprised he's even going for those. Those are really like. I mean, if you're a Ken, you have to go for that stuff. That's what you do as a Ken player. That wow, was. that hurts. What? Did not get his ultra. Come on, Toddy. No confirm from that. He could have card DP. Oh, man. Nah, I think that that on. might cost him the round. We'll yeah. see. Ah, he's playing very poorly. All right. It's okay, though. Yeah, he could have ultra there. Okay. So 1 0 for EX Play. We'll see if Toddy can regain his composure. Yeah, they're both like dropping a lot of stuff. Very yeah. nervous. Well, not to take anything away from play, but I can see why he would be a bit nervous to be the gatekeeper against a Japanese player. You know? He's actually going to send him. No, he's it? doing good though. Yeah, yeah, he is doing good. Wow, jump back. Did not get a full confirm there. Tidy just trying to use his pokes to fight his way out of the corner. No answer. Oh, he did that hot to anyway. That was a nice back dash. Yep. Cross up. Ooh, cross up slash. Good break. Oof. Oh, wow. anti air. I think he tried to anti air and he got snubbed. Sam wow. Kelly holding his head as if to say the same thing. Just dropping combos everywhere. 
Is he gonna DP? No. No. Oh my god, this he's combo. missing so many Carol combos. Brown. Oh, he's playing very nervous right now. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I would expect to see car DPs from his confirms, but maybe he's just missing him. Stand jab. Very nice focus, actually. Yeah, to go back and say before what I was saying about versions of uh, Mago and a few other of the Japanese Tokyo area players have expressed that they like practicing on the arcade version of the game the most. Uh, the Philly uh, sounds like you have to play. Good luck, sir. So the Philly you have to play is match. Anyways, I was saying uh, a lot of the Japanese Tokyo area players are enjoying playing on the arc uh, the PC version of the game. According to them, uh, it's closest to the arcade timing. Cross up slash into Ultra. This is going to be pretty painful, actually. Wow, more than even. EX Plague, small lead here, nice break from Toddy. And actually, EX Plague uh, can close this round out. One solid combo would be all it takes. Focus, no go, nice fireball. Plasma to the chest. No good on the sweep. And Plague really wants to close this round. One solid hit on the Torch Fierce would do it, but he's got to really pick his spot. EX Fireball, lots of projectiles here. Great patience. EX Plague's got him in the corner. No go. Fireball to the face, and it's 1 1. Let's get started. Fight. Scoop. Okay. Stayed in front on that one. Ouch. That was painful. Lots of damage. Scooped again. Another setup. This time anti-air jab stops him. Wow. Damn, something has changed and uh, EX Plague went from going very even with Toddy to now being down. Uh, it's match point for him. Cross up Tatsu. Painful. Ugh. All right, so it looks like Short Jukin, by the way, from Seattle is playing his next match. He's going to be up against Andy Auto Demon, uh, the Akuma slash Goki player. Anyway, Short Jukin was looking good in his first match, so maybe we'll see more of him soon. Focus. Overhead. It looks like Toddy has figured something out here. He's starting to look very comfortable, and EX Plague is unfortunately out of life, out of a chance. All right, EX Plague, man. Too bad for you, sir. But Toddy will advance. Shouts to him. And I don't know if Mr. Tokido-san is watching. But Tokido-san, if you're watching, shouts to you as well. Always a pleasure to see you. Actually, I'm hoping that someone will translate Tokido's book one day because I'm very interested to read it. All right, so the next match is going to be coming up shortly, guys. So far, we see Toddy looking pretty good. Uh, before we continue, I just want to give some love to our sponsors. Uh, first off, I want to give it to ADARC. Shout out to them, ADARC.com. These guys uh, carry sticks and parts for you. Uh, right now, they have a $10 coupon code. Uh, just use the code SPOOKY1 for $10 off. And they have $15 bucks off using the code SPOOKY2015. Uh, lots of sticks and parts all available here at ADARC, including the Canvas series of dual-minded sticks that work for both PS PS3 and 360. Uh, so if you're interested, please visit them at ADARC. You can also follow them on your favorite social media, Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube. Um, also, ADARC is now on Amazon, so make sure to check them out there. You can check out ADARC in their Amazon store, and if you have Prime, you can get the two-day free shipping. You can also get 10% off using the code PRIME10X. That's for ADARC at Amazon. Also, we got some Team Spooky shirts back in stock for you guys. Make sure to check them out. Uh, you've got the Team Spooky old logo style. That's at teespring.com slash team dash spooky dash old logo. Uh, we also have the new style, um, and that's Team Spooky new logo. Um, there's also a few new colors included, and we changed up this one just a bit. Uh, the new logo so that no longer has the Team Spooky text. It's now just the logo. Uh, anyway, thanks, guys. So everybody that's already purchased the shirt, and you know, every all the proceeds go towards supporting Team Spooky directly. So if you want to support Spooky and you are happy about what we do and you want to help us out, the number one thing you can do is buy a shirt. All right, so next match is coming up, guys. I see Mr. Kramer sitting down to play, and we'll see who his opponent is. Looks like his opponent might be Henry Sen. It is. It is. Kramer versus Henry Sen. This is going to be a real old schoolers matchup. Not sure who Henry would choose here. Golden Henry Sen. 
the only man on the East Coast to be a recipient of the Golden Mancast Tournament Edition Fight Stick. <laughs> All right. So Craymore on the player one side of being his Golden Henry Sen player two. Uh, it looks like Henry is opting to go with his Seth. He has quite a few characters at his disposal, including Seth, Honda, Dalsim. Um, I think he has a Rose, a few others as well. So yeah, Henry's scary. Watch out for him. Mad scary. Craymore has a few characters at his disposal as well. So we'll see what happens. Match number one. All right, so Kramer's guy versus Henry Sen is set. Uh, this is a very, very uh, give and take type of matchup. Right now, Henry Sen getting the better of it. Nice pressure after the knockdown. Scoop. Uh, to Cra Charismatic Zay, who thought that Kramer was Dominion. Uh, Kramer and Dominion actually are brothers, so it's no surprise that you would make that mistake. Nice. Great job, Brownhouse. Henry is the one in control. Kramer is just trying to create enough space. Um, to watch for what he's doing. Dive kick, open them up. Okay. Teleport setups. Could have gotten another lightning legs there, but instead he's in the corner. Let's go, Henry. Bush and flip gets nothing. Baited the tandem. And actually, Creamwell has a chance here. No good on the safe jump. Yeah, Seth not very popular in New York right now. Um, no surprise, he's very tough to play. Even some of the best set players like Online Tony have, this, have expressed displeasure at playing the current form of Seth. But every now and then we get to see Punko still go crazy. Jump strong. Got the follow up. Henry's looking really good right now. Corner cross up into 360. Goes for the focus combo. Alright. Lightning legs I imagine. And some more head stomps. Okay. Wow, your Tatsu is not good enough. Just not good enough. And Henry Sen will take game number one. We'll see if Kramer can make an adjustment. Again, Kramer does have a couple other characters at his disposal. Not only stuck uh, playing Guy. All right, and he has to go with Abel in this one. We'll see how it works out. Uh, joining me is going to be Defeat Lee in the booth. What's up, man? Only here for a bit. Apparently, I have to play next on stream. <laughs> okay. Against that. All right. Oh, expected so, switch. Yep. So Henry Sen won the first game on Kramer, and now Kramer is opting to go with his Abel. All right. Nice start for Henry again. Does have to back off there. Henry Sen plays my Abel all the time, but it's not the same as Kramer. Wow, he just TP'd. Are you serious? EX roll to escape the situation. Very nice. Oh man, Henry might be dead. Lots of damage on the string there. Woo! Stand short. See, now I'm wondering, if Henry loses, will he switch to Honda? Honda versus Abel. If he doesn't switch, then he's not safe. I keep forgetting that this is the, the bad Honda. Yeah. He's pretty bad. They did buff him a little bit though. His shorts and jabs got 10 extra damage. Very nice read on that. Ooh, yeah, cool. resets. And Henry just DP's out of it. Why not? Wow. Cool. I think he tried SPD and he got tornado thrown. Uh, so Abel's command grab is invincible to throws, by the way. Very nice reaction on the neutral jump. An EX command grab is strike invincible, but not throw invincible. Yep. Set up. Oh, man. I think you make that worse on yourself if you delay wake up, to be right. honest. It becomes like the old setup. Ooh, nice jump, jump forward, Pierce. Yep. Oh, oh he's no. dead. Oh my god, that no is so much health. Goodness. Very nice comeback from Kramer, actually. Yeah, he picked the right time to go for the scoop. This and is why you play paid. multiple characters, man. <laughs> if he's stuck with Guy, this might have not happened. 
He's good at playing multiple characters, yep. though. He has That's a lot of characters. Not everybody can do that. Oh, he's not switching. I don't think he's taking this seriously. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I don't even know what to say about Honda versus Abel anymore. Nice anti-air. Abel got a weird... I don't even know if you can call this a nerf. He got a weird change, too, though. You know, his overhead. Uh, yeah. It became, it, it, it's more damaging, but now you can't combo after. Yep. Kind of weird. Trying to fight his way through all these long range pokes. Ooh, right space kind of died. Even if he did, uh, change of direction got him. Yeah, I wouldn't have too much. Ooh. Raymore. Going in with Abel. I love this character. Alright. Big combo from Kramor. Safe jump setup. Yeah, wow. But he messed it up. Yeah, I guess so. Yep. I don't know the uh, frames on Seb's DP. Is it four? It's five. Or it's five. Yep. Okay. Oh, he's dead. This Matt Ooh. life. Very Henry nice. Sen's already getting up. <laughs> Yo, Kramor. Oh, uh, it's Antoine who wants to know why Rico is not here that often. Actually, Rico Suave doesn't live in the area, so that's why he's not here that often. Yeah, you want to jump on? Come on, have a seat. All right, so joining us for a while is going to be Short Juke, and he's here from Seattle. What's up? What's up, man? Thanks for joining us. Thank you for having this. Yeah, sure. No problem. So you're here from Seattle. Actually, someone told me that you also play anime games. Is that true? I play Guilty Gear. Aha, there you go. Yeah. Okay, cool, man. How's the tournament going so far? So, so far, it's going pretty nice. Uh, let's see. Bracket-wise, where are we at? Uh, let's see if we can get a little view of the bracket here. So, uh, Sam Kelly is already in the quarters. He has to fight Tone. Uh, RLBS, the guy player is here. Uh, here's the Japanese player that can play us here tonight, Tati. He's gonna have to face Dominion later. And we're about to see this match on stream. It's the Philly versus Zaffarino. All right. Uh, in the loser's bracket, who's still in? Let's see. Um, you're still here somewhere, right? Yep, I've just you. lost. Oh, <laughs> uh, so you faced Auto Demon and, and you were defeated by yeah. him in the loser's bracket. Okay. Um, and here's some of what's going on. Loser's EX play who had a good match versus Tati. He's here. Yep. Oh yeah, so uh, still quite a few players in the tournament. For sure. Hey, so what's going on in the Seattle scene? I haven't been out there in a while. Uh, Seattle scene's actually pretty strong for Ultra right now. Uh, our monthlies get, I want to say, about 40, 50 people. That's a lot of people. That's yeah. amazing, dude. Uh, so we have people coming from Oregon. We have people from, coming from Canada. So uh, CCG Air comes down. So it's always really fun. Yeah, you guys are pretty close to Calgary, right? Uh, to Vancouver. Oh, Vancouver, sorry. Yeah, yeah. So a couple hour drive. It's really nice. Um, so their players... They always have a card that comes down. So cool. It's really cool. That's awesome. All right. So we're going to have Defili versus Zaf. Um, that's the match. Defili's going to be on the player one side is Elena and Zaf.